Hello and welcome to High Ground Gaming. This is Eric, and we'll be playing Game Nine of the 2016 Boston Red Sox season replay or replay of the season. Um, as Boston continues well, to try to go stay undefeated, um, they started off eight and zero um, and just got off of a three-game series, which they swept the Orioles. And now they start a four-game series against the Toronto Blue Jays. And uh, we'll see what can happen here. Um, so today we'll have Rick Porcello pitching for the Red Sox. He's 1-0. He'll be pitching against Ari Dickey, 0-2. So let's check out some Red Sox uh, rankings and everything. Um, so they're first overall in the majors in runs scored. Batting average second overall. 292 on base percentage first in the AL and second overall 375 12 home runs sixth in the AL and 10th overall Let's see stolen bases and we don't really steal a lot but ninth in stolen bases and 15th overall and our pitching is is done well with the runs against and earned run average both first in the majors seventh in whip and fourth in a total, and fourth in the AL, and sixth uh, overall in batting average against, and uh, fourth in the AL. So Blake Swihart is unavailable here, and Rosny Castillo. I believe they're going they're being sent down. I think Blake Hart, Swihart might actually be injured. Um, Rosny Castillo, I think, got sent down. So. That is your, uh, and you can see these are the summary, the stats here. Ortiz leads in home runs and batting average and runs batted in. And uh, Travis Shaw leads the stolen bases. Porcello, uh, Price, and Kelly have all done well so far. Kelly's got four wins. Of course, two of those were in relief. Price and Kelly are tied with strikeouts for 14. And David Price has pitched 15 innings with Joe Kelly right behind him, all tied with Clay Buckholtz. So the starting rotation is all is undefeated here. Well, of course. So, so all right. So let's get the game underway here. See if we can uh, continue the the streak here. So I'm just going to play the Boston game since there is a uh, Washington game later on. So I'm just going to play the uh, Red Sox game. I'm not going to simulcast anything. So, all right. So Ari Dickey against Rick Purcell today. These are the lineups, and we'll go over them as we uh, introduce the players into the game. We play radio is live from Boston. Top of the first. So, all right. So, they'll be playing a four-game set starting today at Fenway Park against the Toronto Blue Jays. Rick Purcell takes the mound today. He's pitched eight in the third innings. His record of 1-0. and Allowed six hits, three walks, and five strikeouts. So he's off to a good start. And he'll be facing a Toronto lineup, which is as follows. Kevin Pillar batting first and playing center field. Josh Donaldson batting second and playing third base. The right fielder, Jose Bautista, batting third. Batting cleanup will be the DH, Edward Encarnacion. Batting fifth, the shortstop, Troy Tulowitzki. Batting sixth and playing first base, Justin Smoke. Batting seventh and playing left field, Michael Saunders. Ryan Goins, the second baseman, bats eighth. And the catcher, Josh Toll, bats ninth. The Blue Jays come into the game with a record of four and six. They played uh, two more games than the Red Sox have. So let's get this game underway.
Here Pilar strikes out for the first out. Pilar came into the game batting 250. Josh Donaldson up now hitting 270 with three homers and six RBIs. Hits it to Bogarts. Fires over to Ramirez. Two down. Two out. Space is empty. Jose Bautista up now. 231 with two homers and seven RBIs. Ground ball to Shaw. Fires out to Ramirez. One, two, three. So the Blue Jays go in order. Red Sox lineup will, against Ari Dickey will be as follows. Mookie Betts batting first and playing right field. Justin Majori, the second baseman, bats second. Batting third will be the shortstop, Xander Bogarts. Landing cleanup, the DH, David Ortiz. Batting fifth will be the first baseman, Hanley Ramirez. Sixth, the third baseman, Travis Shaw. Brock Holt will be playing left field today and batting seventh. The catcher who just called was called up, Christian Vasquez, will be batting eighth. Blake Swihart uh, got sent down. Well, I think he's on the DL actually. Um, so Christian Vasquez will take his roster position. And batting ninth and playing center field, Jackie Bradley Jr. And they'll be facing Ari Dickey, who's 0-2. He's pitched 12 and a third innings so far, 11 hits. Allowed three home runs, nine runs, so it's allowed quite a few runs so far. Nine, uh, three walks and 11 strikeouts, and I think we faced him and beat him already. I think we already had, yeah, we had a series against Toronto, which we swept, obviously. Um, I think Ari Dickey did pitch in that series, and we got to him pretty well. So let's hope we can do the same again today. So Mookie Betts will lead it off. Hitting 289 with two homers and six RBIs. Flies out to Pilar, one down. One out, base is empty. Justin Madroya up now, hitting 289 with four RBIs. Still looking for his first home run. And he's got a long single to right. Batista fires it back in. Uh, I think we're going to try for two here. Try, he's trying to stretch it into a double. And he's safe. He beats the throw. So, one out, man on second. One out double for Dustin Bedroya. Xander Bogart's up now, hitting 256 with a homer and nine RBIs. And he walks. All right, runners on first and second with one out for David Ortiz. Hitting 414 with four homers and 11 RBIs. Ground ball to third. And they turn two. No runs. One hit. And one left on. So it's going to be a 5 4 3 double play. Let's enter. And that'll retire the side. So the Red Sox threaten, but do not score. Edward Encarnacion up now. Hitting 212 with three homers and six RBIs. Has walked 10 times, which is significant. And he walks again. So lead off base runner for the Blue Jays here in the top of the second. Troy Tulowitzki coming up now. Off to a slow start. Just hitting a buck 75 with four RBIs. Still looking for his first homer. And he strikes out. One out, man on first. Justin Smoke will come up now with a runner on first and one out. Hitting 375 with a homer and four RBIs. Come back here to the pitcher. Gonna try to try to turn two here, and nope. Smoke beats the relay throw, and they they do get the lead runner though. Two outs, men on first. Michael Saunders up now, hitting 194 with a homer and six RBIs, and strikes him out. 
So nothing doing for the Blue Jays in the second. No runs, no hits, and one left on. Bottom of the second. All right, so the Red Sox will have Ramirez, Shaw, and Holt against Ari Dickey. Ramirez is hitting 324 with three homers and 10 RBIs. And he doubles. So a leadoff double for the Red Sox in the second. No outs, man on second. Travis Shire will be up now. Hitting 344 with no homers and three RBIs. And strikes out. One out, man on second. Let's see what Brock Holt can do now. Coming into the game batting 261 with two homers and three RBIs. Possible rare play here. Nope, me dribble back to the pitcher. Hopefully Ramirez can move up here. Let's see if Ramirez moves up. And he's not able to get Ramirez. And Holt will have himself an infield single. So runners at the corners with one out. First and third. All right, Christian Vasquez making his first at bat of the season. He would hit 227 with a homer and <laughs> with a homer. <laughs> Ball hit the second, and they turn two to end the inning. That's their second double play turn today. Yeah, so the Red Sox rally is killed again in the seventh. Second. And one left on. Top of the third. All right, Purcell will face Goins. Tool in the top of the order in Pilar. He's got three strikeouts so far in the day. Ball hit the Ramirez. He'll take it himself. One down. One out. Base is empty. Right, Josh Toll up now. Two for four so far in the season. Ground ball to Shaw. Over to Ramirez. And two that'll be two down. Plar struck out his first time up. And he lines out the Holt this time to end the inning. They go down quietly. Nothing doing this half inning. Bottom of the third. All right, so Red Sox will have Bradley Jr., Betts, and Pejoria. Bradley's hitting 296. Still looking for his first home run of the season. Four, out, four runs batted in. Ground ball to Goins. Flips it over to Smoke. One down. One out. Base is empty. Mickey Betts flew out. Center his first time up. Time he hits at the guns. Possible error here. No error on the play. So Goins will retire Betts for the second out. That's the majority. Doubled his first time up. And flies out to Ballard to go one, two, three. They go down quietly. Nothing doing this half inning. Top of the four. Uh, top of the fourth now. Still no score. Donaldson will lead it off. Grounded to short his first time up. Lines out to Betts this time. One out. Base is empty. Jose Bautista coming up now. And grounds out to Shaw. Two outs. Base is empty. All right, Encarnacion come now. Walked his first time up. It's it to Ramirez, and it's a single off his glove. Two outs, men on first. Too low up now. Struck out his first time up. And flies out to Betts to retire the side. No runs, one hit, and one left on. Bottom of the four. All right, the Red Sox will have Bogarts, Ortiz, and Ramirez, the heart of the order. See if they can get something done against Dickey this half. And it's a good start. Lead off walk for Bogarts. No outs, men on first. Hmm. 
Uh, we're not going to do any hit and run here with Poppy. We're just going to let him hit away. Try to do what he does best. And that was not it. <laughs> One out, men on first. All right, Ramirez up now. Doubled his first time up. Grounds out to short. Two little fires over to first, and Bogarts move up to second. Two outs, men on second. Shaw struck out his first time up. And this time doubles into the corner. Bogarts will come around to score. The Red Sox are on the board first here in the bottom of the fourth. So a two out RBI double for Travis Shaw puts the Red Sox on the board. Two outs, men on second. Brock Colt up now, singled his first time up. Hits it to second and throws him out to retire the side. But the Red Sox score one. one. One hit and one left on. And after four full, the Red Sox lead one to nothing. So, all right, see if Porcello can continue to shut the Blue Jays down. Smoke will be up now. And, ooh, Porcello, who has great control, walks him. So, lead off. Base runner for the Blue Jays here in the fifth. Saunders up now. Just misses that sh home run and strikes One out. out. out Goins grinded out the first his first time up. Could be a double play. Nope. Salad decides just to go to first. Smoke will move up to second. All right, so Josh Troll up now, grounded out the third his first time up. Looping line drive here. Uh-oh. This could be trouble. So, ugh. Need 22 or lower. And we don't. So it looks like the Blue Jays are going to tie the score. On a two-out single by Josh Troll. Two outs, men on first. So Pilar up now. So I think it's the fir first hits of Toronto. One run, one hit, and one left on. Bottom of the fifth. All right, see if the Red Sox can answer and get back the lead here. Vasquez the lead out, ground into a double play the first time. Grounds out to Donaldson. One down. One out, base is empty. Jackie Bradley Jr. up now. Ground out to second his first time out. And flies out to Bautista. Two down. Two out, space is empty. Come on, Betts. 0 for 2. That's a rare play here. And it's going to be a rare play. 46. Chopper over the mound. Second base of backhands the ball. Makes off balance throw to first. Gets him. So we head to the six, tied up at one. And Donaldson strikes out for the first out of the inning. One out, base is empty. Bautista up now, grounded out to third twice. And strikes out this time. Two outs, base is empty. Right. Encarnacion up now, walked and singled. And he strikes out the side. So Priscilla comes back with a strong inning. Strikes out the side. So let's see if the Red Sox can capitalize off this momentum here. Bottom of the sixth. Joria Bogarts and Ortiz to face Dickey. Strikes him out. And they let Dickey get off the hook in the first couple yeah, innings there. When they could have scored but failed to. Bogart's up now. And he doubles into the corner. So a one out double for Bogart's. One out, man on second. Big Poppy coming up now, 0 for 2. And then he walks. 
So first and second, one down. One out. Men on first and second. See what Hanley and Ramirez go. Oh, possible wild pitch here. No. So Toll blocks the pitch there in the dirt. Men on first and second. And he flies out to right. Bogarts will hold. Two outs, men on first and second. All right, so going to need a two out hit by Shaw. We doubled and knocked in a run in the last time up. And he strikes out. So the Red Sox cannot get the lead back. No runs, one hit, and two left on. Top of the seven. All right, Tulowitzki, Smoke, and Saunders will face Porcello. So rare play here. Nope, it's going to be a foul. And it's a foul out. So the first baseman, Ramirez, comes over and makes the catch near the stands. One out, base is empty. Smoke up now, 0 for 1. And he strikes out. Two out, base is empty. So Purcell now has 8 Ks on the day. Make that 9. And that retires the side. So Purcell seems to be getting better as the game goes on. Holt will lead it off. 1 for 2 with a single. And he's got himself his second hit of the day. No outs, men on first. They're bringing in a new pitcher. Let's see here. Gavin Floyd will come in to pitch. Dickey's day is done. Pitched six plus innings. Responsible for a halt at first. Ooh. I don't think we want to hit and run with Vasquez. It's not that great a bunter. Let me look at the... We have Hannigan to back him up. Well, Vasquez is a good, good defensive catcher, though. Yeah, we'll let him. We'll let him hit away. Let's just see. Maybe, maybe we'll uh, try to steal with Holt here. He only has four stolen bases on New Year, though. Hmm. I'd hate to have him turn, bounce into a double play, though. Now yeah, we'll see if we can get the jump. Why not? Try to mix it up here a little bit. Nope. So. No outs. Man on first. All right, we're just gonna hit away. He strikes out. Well, he's need to hit into a double play, so let's. Not the worst thing. Jackie Bradley up now. 0 for 2 on the day. Still looking for his first home run. And he strikes out too. Ooh, boy. Two outs, men on first. All right, Mookie Betts, come on, baby. 0 for 3. Two for something big here. And nope, leaping catch by Tulowitzki, and that'll end the inning. So the Red Sox cannot score. Marcelo up. We'll face Gorns, Toll, and Pilar. Hit the third, and Shaw retires Gorns for the first out. And doesn't get a. Ah. Josh Toll, one for two with a single. Round ball the third, and Shaw retires him also. Two outs, base is empty. Pull her up now, 0 for 3. And strikes him out. That's the 10th strikeout of the game. 10 Ks on the day for Priscilla. An easy inning to score, 1, 2, 3. Bottom of the eighth. 
All right, come on, Red Sox. Time's running out here. Pedroia, Bogarts, and Ortiz. Trying to keep that undefeated streak going. Ooh, possible. Come on, Pedroia, beat it out. Ah. All right, Bogarts, come on, baby. He's one for one, doubled and walked twice. Come on, Poppy. Time for a big hit. Oh, baby. Big Poppy comes through in the clutch here. Gives the Red Sox the lead. Number five on the on the uh, season. So Kimbrell start loosening up in the bullpen here. Two outs, bases empty. Whew. Hanley Ramirez up now, doubled and grounded out, and flew out to right. It's the shortstop, and he's got himself an infield single, possibly. And he's safe. Beats it out. Two outs, men on first. He does have nine stolen bases. I think we're going to try to steal, see if we can get the jump. He's going to try it. See what happens. Pick off possible error here. Oh, not quite. In the dirt, but. Gets back safely. Two outs, men on first. All right. So, sharp now. One for three with a double and an RBI. And he got himself a single. Ramirez has got to move over to third. So run is at the corners with two down. Two outs, men on first and third. Brock Holt. Brock Holt, two for three. I bring in Brett Cecil, and we're going to counter here with Chris, B Chris Young. Who hits lefties really well. All right. Let's see what he can do against Cecil. Cecil's pitched two in a third inning, allowed one hit, walked one, and struck out three. See if they can add to the lead here. Ah, strikes out. So Chris Young fails to come through, but one run, three hits, and two left on. Red Sox take a two to one lead, going to the top of the ninth. They'll bring in Kimbrell to try to close it. Priscilla pitched a fine game. In line for the win. And we're going to bring in Chris Young to play left field. Let's check our defense here. We definitely want our best defense out here. I think we got our best defense we're going to get. So, all right. Yeah, I'm glad we left Vasquez in. So here we go, Josh John. Ooh, it's gonna be tough though. Josh Donaldson, Batista, and Encarnacion, all their power threats are up. So let's see what Kimball can do here. Good start. Strikes out Donaldson for the first out. One out, base is empty. Jose De Batista up now. 0 for 3. And strikes out Batista. Two outs, base is empty. Right, still got one more to get through. The Blue Jays are down there last out with Edwin Encarnacion. He's one for two with a single. Lines out to Betts, and that'll be the ball game. Wins a close one. Woo. So the Red Sox win a squeaker there thanks to a clutch home run by Big Poppy. David Ortiz to give the Red Sox a 2-1 to one victory and to preserve their unbeaten streak to start the 2016 season. So it'll be nine in a row. 
So let's take a look at the stats. So Porcello gets the win. Goes to two and zero. Kimbrell gets his fourth save. Gavin Floyd gets the loss. Surrendered the home run to Big Poppy. Purcell gets the MVP. That's a good choice. Even though Big Poppy could have probably won it with his home run, but Purcell pitched eight. Yeah, he only allowed two hits and in eight innings. One run, two walks, and ten strikeouts. All right, Dickey pitched a great game himself. Six innings, six in six hits, one run, three walks, and four strikeouts. Let's check the Red Sox offense here. Ramirez, Shaw, and Holt each had two hits. Big Poppy only had one, but that was a big one. Uh, ironically, his average is 406. Somebody else I know hit 406 in 1941. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, the Blue Jays only got two hits on the day. Encarnacion had one, and Josh Toll had the other. Kimball came in and shut the door there, striking out two of the three batters he faced during his fourth save. So a fine day for, and a good victory for the Red Sox. We move to nine and zero. The Blue Jays fall to four and seven. So the Red Sox move to nine and zero. So all right. So thank you for joining me. The Red Sox again moved to, like I said, moved nine to nine and zero. Oh. They'll try to extend the streak tomorrow, so join us for that. They'll be playing Toronto again, and it'll be David Price will take the hill, and against Marco Estrada, that should be a good pitching matchup. So we'll see what happens. See if the Red Sox can extend their unbeaten streak. Until then. This has been Eric from Higher Ground Gaming, and we'll see you in the next video. God bless. Bye-bye.